Susie and Jeff, the family says that this video is giving them answers tonight. As you can see behind me, there's still a few people out here. Earlier, there were dozens of people at this visual. Tonight is the anniversary of that man's death. Watch this, a struggle between 23-year-old Cesar Rodriguez and a Long Beach police officer on a metro rail platform is all caught on camera, shot by security cameras aboard a Blue Line train. This happened one year ago, and the family says the officer threw Rodriguez into the path of the oncoming train that took his life. Rodriguez's sister says it took months for them to get the video. And when we seen that video, it was like a lot of like questions that we had, you know, as a family, we were able to like get those answers. But the Long Beach Police Department says Rodriguez accidentally fell back during the scuffle with the officer. We were there the night the rescue crews responded. The family says for 20 minutes, Rodriguez was pinned between the train and platform. He later died at the hospital. He has family. He's able to go back to his family. My brother didn't make it back home. Police say Rodriguez was being stopped on suspicion of not paying his fare, and then drugs were found on him, and that's when he tried to run from the officers. Then a fight between an officer and Rodriguez happened. The family's attorney says the officer never should have tackled him so closely to the tracks. It's an example of just a complete disregard for safety. Now, the Long Beach Police Department says that the officer is still employed with them, but they cannot comment any further because of this pending lawsuit. Reporting live tonight in Long Beach, Brittany Hopper, back to you guys in the studio. All right, Brittany, thank you.